Welcome back to Austin awesome News TV and today we're going to first look at Mikel Arteta making confident Arsenal vow as Arsenal boss hints at Martin Odegaard transfer return and then we're going to look at Arsenal on red alert as £40 million transfer target Emiliano Buendia decides to leave Norwich. So the first transfer line states that Mikel Arteta makes confident Arsenal vow as Arsenal boss hints at Martin Odegaard transfer return. So the reports are stating that Arsenal finished the Premier League season in 8th place. Arsenal failed to finish inside the European qualification places despite beating Brighton 2-0 on the final day of the Premier League season. It has been a disappointing year for the Gunners, but Mikel Arteta is confident about turning things around at the club. Mikel Arteta has admitted that he is confident about the club's future before hinting at a potential move for Martin Odegaard this summer. The Gunners finished outside the European qualification places after a disappointing year at the Emirates. The Arsenal board still seems to have full faith in Mikel Arteta though and the Spaniard has praised the improvements he has seen from his players in recent months. Yeah, we can't go against that, he said, when asked if they can build on their momentum for next season. I can tell you what I see and what are my feelings when I watched the team a few months ago and when I watch the, the team right now regardless of the results. In my opinion, we are in a much better place and we will be in a much better place. Hopefully we can take the club where we want. Mikel Arteta also said after the win over Brighton on Sunday that transfer negotiations were set to take place over a potential move for Martin Odegaard this summer. The Norwegian has spent the second half of the season lighting up the Emirates, prompting talk of a possible permanent deal from Real Madrid. We have a very clear and strong opinion on what we'd like to do, Mikel Arteta explained. He is not our player, we will have discussions in the next few weeks. We respect he is a Real Madrid player and we will have those conversations. We've tried to make everything that we could to get Martin performing for the team, which I think he's done, and he's adapted really well to our play of playing and our football club. Hopefully, we have given him the hope and the feeling that this could be a good place for him here. When Arsenal feels confident of a deal, Mikel Arteta added, I don't know, it's not in our hands. So it looks like Mikel Arteta makes confident Arsenal vow as Mikel Arteta hints at Martin Odegaard transfer return. And with the Premier League season over for the Gunners, and if you're an Arsenal fan right now, you're probably happy that it's all over now. It's been a horrific season in terms of an Arsenal fan. It's been probably one of the lowest points in Arsenal's history. After 25 years, no European football. So in terms of Mikel Arteta's Arsenal, we're in a new low. We're probably in another lowest point in our time. But hopefully this is the minimum point we can get to and now we can only move forward from this situation onwards. Mikel Arteta is very confident about a Martin Odegaard transfer return. But we have to wait and see where Martin Odegaard thinks he deserves to play if he wants to stay at Real Madrid or come back to Arsenal another loan or maybe a permanent transfer. We have to wait and see how the Martin Odegaard transfer saga pans out. So this nicely takes us on to the second piece of transfer news, which states that Arsenal on red alerts as £40 million transfer target Emiliano Buendia decides to leave Norwich. So the reports are stating that the 24-year-old playmaker is set to leave the Canaries this summer despite achieving promotion to the Premier League. Arsenal will have competition from Aston Villa in the race to sign Norwich City midfielder Emiliano Buendia this summer, according to reports. Buendia is expected to move in the transfer window despite helping Norwich achieve promotion and will have no shortage of suitors with the player believing it's the right time to take the next step. The 24-year-old playmaker has enjoyed a brilliant season for the Canaries who claimed the championship trophy after finishing 6 points clear of Watford at the summits. Buendia scored 15 goals and registered 16 assists in the league and won the Championship Player of the Year award. He recorded one goal and seven assists at Daniel Farker's side were relegated from the Premier League last season, so all he has experienced at the top flights. Although Norwich will now get another attempt at the Premier League following their promotion, they are expected to do so without Emiliano Buendia. According to The Athletic, Norwich are aware of their interest in their star player and accept that they will have to let him go this summer if the right bid comes in. 
Arsenal and Aston Villa are known admirers of Buendia, while the report states that a major continental outfit have also registered their interest recently. His former availability means that the Canaries are bracing themselves for a classic tug of war over the Argentine when their transfer window opens on June 9th for 12 weeks. Emiliano Buendia is under contract until June 2024 and the Athletic says it would require a fee of more than £40 million to lure him away from Carrot Road. That is partly because some of the proceeds have to go to Getafe where Norwich signed him from just £1.29 million which estimates to €1.5 million Euros three years ago. While Norwich are understood to be prepared to sell, they are not in a rush to move on Buendia and fellow standout players like Max Ahrens and Todd Cantwell. Arsenal manager Mikel Arteta and technical director Edu are fans of Emiliano Buendia and are prioritising the signing of a creative presence this summer. The Gunners want to sign Martin Odegaard on a permanent deal from Real Madrid following a successful loan spell with the club. Emiliano Buendia represents a realistic alternative to the Norwegian, while Aston Villa are also seriously in interested with Ross Barkley set to return to parent club Chelsea and Trezeguet injured. Villa want a player to play centrally alongside Jack Grealish rather than someone to replace their star man who generally plays on the left of a 4-3-3 formation. Also are readying themselves for a busy summer with the club targeting around 5 new players in the transfer window. The Gunners are known to be after a new left back and right back but they could also recruit a striker, midfielder and goalkeeper. So it looks like the Gunners and especially regarding Emiliano Buendia also are on red alert as he decides to leave Norwich. And when it comes to Arsenal, they only have one major competition at the moment and that is Aston Villa. So you have to wait and see if the Gunners are really interested in Emiliano Buendia and see how this transfer pans out. But then that guys remain blessed. Stay tuned for the next video and peace.